Hi guys, welcome to our latest listing in Fry and Barnet. This one's actually a five bedroom, three bathroom character house in the heart of Fry and Barnet, on one of the most popular roads in the area, on the corner of Holly Park Road and Carlton Road. This house actually exudes beauty and character. Come on through, let me actually show you round. So as soon as you actually come into the property, you're actually faced with a beautiful entrance hall. The high ceilings are a great feature, the wooden flooring is a great touch. And what's also special about this house is it's got its own utility room with a fully functional washing machine and boiler in here. And it's all away from the actual property. Through here, you actually have a great size reception room. It's a double size reception room. And what's also really nice is that you've got these beautiful sash windows throughout. You've got these lovely high ceilings Beautiful wooden flooring, but a picture rail just to give that extra bit of character. The reception actually leads us to a beautiful modern kitchen diner. And what's also really nice about it is the fact that you've got this beautiful granite worktop throughout. It's a fully functional kitchen with enough space to certainly have a dining table and chairs. The French doors that take you out to the garden are a beautiful touch. The garden certainly a low maintenance garden and really, really private. It's also really quiet around here, what you certainly don't expect to be in the sort of North London. What I really like about the house is the fact that you've got a shower room or bathroom on every single level. The shower room in here is actually a great touch and you've got a double shower in here, but also the guest cloakroom, just allowing guests to obviously not have to go upstairs, I think is a great feature. Let's go upstairs. This is actually the second bathroom on the half landing and what's also nice is the fact that you've got such a bright bathroom. The property is not exposed and you've got these lovely tiles throughout. I love the character of the staircase, it just gives it that extra feeling of character that a lot of these houses don't actually offer. On the first floor you actually have four really generous sized bedrooms. This is actually the primary suite where you have fitted wardrobes throughout and what's also nice is these lovely sash windows that just allow a lot of natural light to flood through. The gas central heating throughout and the new carpets give it that luxury feel. But what's also nice is the character high ceilings that this house actually has. This is actually the second bedroom, which is a bit of an odd shaped bedroom, but I like it because it gives it that extra bit of character. You could certainly position a bed and a wardrobe in here quite comfortably. And the fact that you've got these big windows just allow a lot of natural light to flood through. The ceiling cornices are a great touch and I'm glad that they retained the number of character features that this house once had. So this would actually take us into the third bedroom, which is actually a really good sized double bedroom. Again, you've got these lovely big windows which allow a lot of natural light to flood through. The high ceilings again give it that extra bit of volume and I love the fact that you've got gas central heating in all the rooms. This will actually take us onto bedroom number four which for me is actually a really good size study, spare room or child's room. Again you know well proportioned windows, gas central heating and these lovely carpets just give you that extra bit of comfort. And as we come up to the third floor, what's really nice is this room can be actually ideal for a teenager. You've got a lovely sized room with a Velux window and gas central heating throughout. I can imagine a teenager out here with his mates coming over playing games. What's also really cool about it is the fact that it's got its own ensuite bathroom. The bathroom is a three-piece suite, but what's also cool about it is the amount of storage this house actually has. You're bombarded with storage in the eaves that goes all the way throughout the house. Just give it that extra space that a lot of families will be looking for. 